When urban planner Milagros Laquona looks at the Tappan Zee Bridge, she sees beyond the busy traffic and imagines a walkway to nature. I don't know if it's because human kind has uh, 80% of water in our system, but there is something special for us humans in connection with the water. And the fact that we can be on top of this uh, bridge and, and looking at the river, magnificent views. She is part of a group called the Tappan Bridge Park Alliance. They want to turn this bridge into a three mile long park. It would be filled with trees, grass, benches, artwork, people walking, jogging, biking, all over the Hudson River. It was just a fanciful idea until last month when Governor Andrew Cuomo asked his staff to study whether it would be really possible. The bridge is 56 years old and must be replaced because it no longer complies with vehicle safety codes for the interstate system. Plans for the new bridge to be built nearby are now being drafted. And the question of the old bridge is exciting. One of the main questions is, you're designing a new bridge, what do you do with the old bridge? The expectation was you take it down. To take it down costs about $150 million. Uh, what they're exploring is, could you leave it up and turn it into an amenity, a greenway? It's a new trend in the New York City area, taking industrial landmarks and turning them into parks. In Manhattan, Robert Hammond is one of the creators of the High Line. It's a park built on an old elevated railroad line. He says the plant life is key to its success. It's a way to experience the city, you know, when nature takes back over. The High Line opened in 2009, and it's a hit with New Yorkers. I think it's a lovely way to keep history alive and to bring it into um, our modern use of space. And it's yep. really cool because it really is a little oasis in the middle of the city. North of the city, another abandoned railroad bridge has been turned into what's called Walkway Over the Hudson. It's filled with people even on the coldest of days. Fred Schaefer advocated converting it into a park for years. But people love the water, and especially the Hudson River. It's the most beautiful river in the world. The proposed Tappan Bridge Park, with its three miles of greenery, would be the most ambitious bridge reimagining yet. Ted Shaffrey, Associated Press, Terrytown, New York.